What's up, YouTube? It's Twig, and today I'm bringing you guys another uh, Moab gameplay. Should be pretty interesting. It's on dome, pretty fast paced, and I do pick up the Moab really quick, or it's around three minutes, which I consider pretty quick. And um, yeah, it was really awesome to get. And if you guys noticed, I am using a uh, Blue Snowball microphone instead of uh, the Apple EarPods, which is uh, this Blue Snowball is a pretty professional mic, and it sounds really good. If you guys like it, uh, be sure and let me know what you think. And so, yeah, um, basically, I just wanted to mainly talk about the gameplay in this commentary. I, this was a really fun gameplay to get, and I, it just felt freaking awesome when I uh, busted the Moab out because uh, I've been trying to get a Moab on Dome for quite a while now and I was playing completely solo in this and I haven't really played in a party throughout Modern Warfare 3 and so if any of you guys want to party up be sure and hit me up uh, let me send me a YouTube message tweet at me uh, leave a comment below and uh, we, can, we can get into matches and go for Moabs and stuff because I'm finding it's getting pretty hard to uh, they all they all spawn back there at our flag when they have two flags because our, uh, I got teammates on both flags right now and it scared the freak out of me when I went back to A but anyway uh, I'm finding it really hard to pick up getting Moabs and then going for doubles because I'm dying from people in Dead Man's Hand and Marty Dawn and uh, just campers in corners and I know that's a part of the game it just seems like it's happening more and more and um, I think it would be pretty fun just to party up and start hitting up some double Moabs and stuff. So if any of you guys want to, just let me know. As far as uh, this gameplay goes, though, um, basically I'm just controlling this part of the this side of the map right here by loading. I do go middle a lot and um, sit back here at uh, front satellite. So. We are holding C and A flag, and usually I like to turn it the other way around and hold C and B, just so we can get them at A and they spawn on each side of the dome and inside dome. But uh, it just worked out really well for us holding them at B flag. And uh, sometimes the spawns can get pretty messed up, but my teammates did a good job of staying off B, and I, I wasn't talking to them or communicating them uh, at all throughout this match. It was just... Uh, just me maneuvering through the map and picking up kills and I just uh, I was in the zone <laughs> and I was able to drop a Moab and um, I just as I play on this map more and more it just get I think I didn't really like it at first and now I'm just I love playing on this map because I find it a challenge to get Moabs and when I do get them uh, on this map it just it, it feels amazing just because I work I work so hard for them but I, you do die from stealth bombers a lot since uh, if you do hold these outside flags and you can die inside bunker but right there guys I pop I pick up the Moab right there and um, yeah it, but like I was saying you do die a lot from uh, stealth bombers and stuff if you're holding these outside flags and you can die inside B too it's just uh, it's just a really challenging map and uh, I find it really really fun to play and so if you guys like this Moab be sure and hit the like button I'll stop the commentary now we do end up winning so if I can remember I'll uh, post a screenshot at the end of this video showing uh, what I win I put up over 60 kills uh, running specialist only and um, but yeah I'll post a screenshot up at the end of this video so you guys can uh, see that we did win and I put up over 60 kills so um, with that said I'll catch you guys in the next video uh, be sure and uh, check us out on Twitter if you have Twitter and I hope you enjoyed it thanks a lot peace Alright guys, thanks for checking that video out. Uh, if you want to check out another Moab, um, click the link in the bottom left hand corner of your screen. It's a link to the Moab that we posted up yesterday. Or you can check out the link in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Of the, it's a video of the Belkin Zero stand review. Uh, it's a great stand, looks great. Uh, you can use it with any laptop. So uh, if you want to go check that out, be sure and hit it up. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.